Okay, for this task, we're going to go ahead and do the initial assembly of the top section. You'll need the top plate. You'll need 12 number 6 by 32 1 inch screws. You'll need the three vertical supports that you should have put nuts in by now. Remember, nuts go in from the injection molded side. Okay. And you'll need the three stepper motor assemblies. Okay, and this is real easy to do, and it's quick, so let's get started. First we'll go ahead and we will do the Y-axis. You want to make sure that because uh, this face is actually facing up, that you want to orient the T-slot nuts towards the base. So you do that, just stick them in the air like so, okay? Turn it and we'll grab the next one and just work your way around it like so. And you'll notice that I've got lacing tape on my wiring. You might want to do that for yours as well. It makes it for a neater assembly, better wire management. Unicorns enjoy it. You know the deal. Okay, so. We've got these three, so let's go ahead and carefully flip it over and uh, get the screws installed. And hopefully nothing falls out. Get to look at the back of my head. Lucky you, huh? Okay. Two screws in each one. And as before, you just get them started in those nylon nuts because you don't want to run the risk of stripping them. And the next two. Okay, so now that we've got those started, it's time to grab the handy dandy screwdriver and nail them down. Okay, flip it back upside, right side up, and install the verticals. These go in smooth side out, just like you did in the bottom. No surprises here at all, except they might try to fall out when you flip it upside down, like so. And they just drop the screws in. And there we go. One base or top section ready to go. And you're ready to move on to the next task.